Hi, this is Mahadi from InstaWebWorks. Today, I want to introduce you to our extension, Easy SharePoint for Zone CRM. To install the extension, go to your CRM settings. And under the settings, you will find Marketplace and click All. Then search for Easy SharePoint. Easy SharePoint. Then you will get to see this one developed by InstaWebWorks. Now click on start free trial, continue, agree, authorize, then continue to install, install for all users, and that's it. After the installation is finished, it will redirect you to the settings page of Easy SharePoint for Zone CRM. The first thing you have to do is to authenticate SharePoint and authenticate Zoho. So click on authenticate. You'll need to be logged in to your SharePoint and just don't close it. Just minimize it and check whether it's verified. Okay, it's verified. Next, authenticate Zoho. Select spawn, accept. I'm going to check whether this is authenticated or not. Okay. So initially, you can see there are five modules leads contact accounts deals and campaigns you can see the uh, leads and the campaigns has uh, red color but the other ones are blue it's because uh, i've installed this extension before and these three were set up before but the leads and the campaigns weren't set up so to set up you need to go to that module and select the root folder I mean the SharePoint site. So I'm just going to select this test SharePoint site and then select the documents over there. And then I'm going to uh, select leads and save. Over here, we can change the folder structure, uh, which is the naming convention of our folder. So we can change it. Uh, over here, we can go space and press on shift, then three on our keyboard and select the field which we want uh, the folder name to be. So I can say last name, uh, folder, something like that. We can also create subfolders on creation of a lead if we want. I'm not going to show it right now. Uh, just save it. Agree and it's saved now if i go to leads and create a lead but let's just go to sharepoint and see uh in the test sharepoint site under the document uh, under the leads we don't have any folder right so let's go to leads and create a new lead so last name can be Hassan and can add admin at instawebworks.com.au as the email and just hit save. Over here you can see the SharePoint folder ext. This is empty. If I hit refresh then I should be able to see the ID was populated automatically. Okay. And if we go to our sh uh, SharePoint, then you can see under the leads, the Hassan folder was created based on the naming convention, the folder structure that we provided. So now if we go to our uh, lead and click on easy SharePoint, we should be able to see a related list 
widget for our extension. So initially the folder is empty, but we can create a folder, test Mahadi. And you can see in the SharePoint, if you go inside, then that folder was created real time. We can upload any file from here. So desktop, we can add maybe text files, doc documents, okay. And we can also upload images. And this is the grid view, right? So we also have another grid view where we get to see a little preview of our files. And we also have a list view. Over here, you can search for your items. So like test Madi, you can search for it. You also have a lot of options for your files in the related list widget like you can rename any file so this is test png i can change it to another test another rename it so if we go to our sharepoint this was test but this will be changed to another so it was changed and we also have a copy cut download option can click on it and it will be downloaded in your PC you can delete also get external share links download only you can delete the file as well okay you can also get a view preview of the item over here Next, you can sync your attachments uh, from your CRM. So let me just add an attachment over here. Upload a file. Attach. Then click on settings. And you can click on sync attachment. And the file from the attachment will be downloaded to your SharePoint and also uploaded over here. You can see it was uploaded. Okay, you also have other options as well in the settings. You can click on refresh if, if you wanna, if you see any sort of problems, you can click on the refresh and it will refresh. You can click on go to SharePoint folder. You can share the current folder as download only, or you can give full access from here. Thank you for watching this video. We will create more tutorials for Easy SharePoint for Zoho CRM. If you have any questions or if you have trouble installing, or if you have any queries about our extension, please email us at admin at instawebworks.com.au and we will see you in the next one. Thank you very much.